Welcome back. It's time to meet another local artist in our Fresh Gallery Spala. Say hello to Wood Artist and member of Fresh Gallery, Carl Roll. Is that how you say your last name? Rao. Rao. Okay. Yes, how are you today? I'm good. How are you doing? Yes, I'm great and I'm already impressed. Why, thank you. How did, how did, how did you get into working in this medium, working, um, working with uh, Wood? I, I grew up in rural Missouri. Um, I've carried a pocket knife since I've been eight years old. Uh -huh. So, I mean, started I just, out as a whittler then. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. And, and then it kind of progressed from there. I've actually got a degree in interior design where I got to do sculptures, watercolors, oils, and all that. So, about 15 or so years ago, I decided to pick my art back up again. And I've been working in wood and I still incorporate other materials and stuff into them. So, so this is something that I feel like you are born with this, um, be, to be able to have an eye for this kind mm. of thing, you know, and to keep all your fingers while you're doing it. I've that's got a, them all. That's a yes. talent right there too. <laughs> <laughs> How did you get inspired to start working with wood to begin with? Um, like I said, um, going in with, with interior design, it was through the art department. Mm -hmm. And uh, I've always been more inspired to draw and play with things and shape and all of that. And, um, I would love to be a studio artist, so eventually I just convert our garage into that, and the wife uh, doesn't get to park in it anymore. <laughs> Sad to say, but it's true. I get that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know, I'm I'm looking at some of you know the work that you have here, and there are pieces that I can understand. It's like, oh, I I get how you do that. However, when you're working on things like you have here in the mm -hmm. middle, what took you away from something that is, an, uh, you know, basically you're carving a surface. Mm -hmm. Now you're carving through things. A 3D shape, uh, um, yeah. yeah. Most, several of these over here I've actually got drawings for. Okay. So I, I can visualize from a 2D image to a 3D. Mm -hmm. And so I know where I'm going in the direction. So I'll actually draw it up and then carve it out. This is my most recent one. I just literally finished it this morning. Mm -hmm. uh, so, um, now, how long would that have taken you? It's taken me right under 40 hours. Wow. You have patience, uh, <laughs> a lot of patience. Now, as I understand it, also, you kind of use here what nature gives you. Yes. Um, I'd say 98% of my stuff is all reclaimed material. Uh -huh. wow. um, whether it's uh, logs from our firewood or I'll go by and find some walking sticks and stuff set up by low water bridges and you can clean stuff like that. Uh, the ones that are in front of you, Tom, yeah. that's actually my In the Reed series, mm -hmm. and those are literally pieces from other sculptures that I've incorporated into those. Oh, okay, all right. I say, the one I recognize outside of a fish, boom, cattails right mm -hmm. there. Oh. That, is, that is beautiful. Yeah. And, and that's part of what that one is, kind of like when you go down to the creek or a pond and you've got uh -huh. the cattails and everything else that's around you. It just kind of gives you that feel of nature and in long water. Do you also look at the different burling in wood and yes. the, the different way that it lies? Oh yeah, there's um, a lot of my sculptures. I'll find some something that's got some good grain into it, mm -hmm. and then I'll turn that into sculpture. Um, like I said, a lot of the walking sticks and branches end up walking sticks. I also make wands for the Harry Potter fans. Oh, so mm -hmm. uh, yeah. and I, well, I was gonna okay. Since you you make wands for like the Harry Potter fans, mm -hmm. are all your works just things you do, or do you also are you commissioned to do things? Um, I do some commission work. I'm working on a cane right now for a gal that's got a wolf head on the top of it. Ah. Uh -huh. um, I've done a um, walking stick for a family. Their uh, father was in the the Marines. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I said a little Marine button on top, and I've also would burn UMC down the side of it. Yeah. And uh, so it's it's a special piece for the family. And yeah. Something that he'll treasure for as long as he can carry it. So people can see your work at Fresh Gallery. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is a small example of what I've got there. Um, and yeah, I do commission work, so. Website, things like that where they can you know, kind of keep I've got a Facebook page under Carl's Creations. I've also got an Instagram, which I don't do as much with. Uh -huh. But I, I've still got some of my better pieces on there. and. It gives you an example of what I can do. These are so detailed and just absolutely beautiful. Thank you for sharing yeah, with us and, and our viewers. I appreciate as well. being here. Beautiful work. Thank you very much. All right, we'll be right back. 